and soon and he would consider returning to the hustler casino live stream now i don't know if if they're on board with that because i never saw them reply to the tweet but um <laughs> you think she's innocent um i think that we have to treat her as if she's innocent because there's no proof that she's not innocent at some point you have to move on so i did move on and somehow she followed me on twitter which i was um happy about but um I don't have that many followers, so I'm not sure why she followed me. Oh no, my night. Man, just cleaning up. <laughs> God. He's just moving around the board taking pieces. <laughs> yes, innocent until proven guilty. So no, I mean Garrett didn't give her the money back because of course he thinks that she did it. And then Brian the casino worker who who may or may not have been colluding with her disappeared. So there's, you know, Hustler Casino Live re released their internal investigation findings, which were they did have some, some areas that they needed to tighten the security in, but there was no evidence of cheating. So that's what happened. You need far more proof than that to not pay a poker hand. Well, she voluntarily gave Garrett the money. So it's a little bit more layered than that. But I know what you're saying. I think she she obviously did it for one of two reasons. Either she felt guilty because she knew she cheated, or she gave Garrett the money because she felt pressured and under all this duress. And, you know, it is true if you want to be on that show, you want to please everybody. Um, so either answer, either reason is believable to me. <laughs> but I get what you're saying. They got about as much as they had on Hans Neiman when he beat Carlson. <laughs> well, you know, I felt like that there was more suspicious evidence in the Robbie situation, but at the end of the day, then nothing was proven. Yeah, I won. But, um, <laughs> yay. Your fear is if you start beating Ben on a regular basis, he will stop having tournaments. That's a pretty good fear. <laughs> That's funny, Stonkfish. A little, a little grain of truth in that. <coughs> so I did not see Robbie in Las Vegas. I saw a lot, tons of people. Berkey, Caitlin Kameski, Veronica Brill. I never saw Joey Ingram. I saw the other people that I already mentioned. And tons of other people. I saw a, a bunch of poker players. And I had a great time, but it was um, pretty intimidating, the World Poker Tour. I wasn't the worst player, but, you know, I have a lot to learn. And that's for sure. What was my best hand? Man, I'll have to think about it. I was just 
feeling like I was car dead all day. Well, my best hand playing cash game is I had quad twos. So I sneaked in there and everybody chuckled.